I think I can handle it from here, thank you. <laughs> I just assumed you'd be taller. I only have a minute, so perhaps we ought to get straight down to business. How can I be of help? You mean besides not killing me and my family? Not exactly, because that's not negotiable. What the hell did I ever do to you? Stick your fingers, dear. You absconded with some rather vital data, so just return it and all shall be forgiven. I didn't take shit from you. I played my game and died, got sent home, end game. So Alita West still has it? I don't know who has it, and quite frankly, I don't care. I just need you to leave me and my family alone. Okay, you're either lying or expendable in your ignorance. Either way, your death continues to be my only viable goal. Now what makes you so certain I won't just kill you? Right here. I am not that careless, dear. Now I'm in a peripheral of my own. Uh, that doesn't mean I can't deal you an awful lot of pain. Though I do think you'd just pop right out of that clone at the first sign of trouble. And why would you say that? Now you see, we got people like you where I'm from. Folks with power, money, love to walk all over the rest of us. Not the kind to suffer through anything close to a real fight. I have lived through more extremities than you can possibly imagine. It would crush your tiny little mind. So please don't care to lecture me about pain. Oh, I don't want to lecture you. I just want to snap your fucking neck. <sighs> Do you feel it? The darkness closing in? Let it be preparation for when I kill you and it's real. <laughs> See, I got a foothold in your world now. Next time, I'm coming for you instead.